Shushrata. Plastic surgery, which most of the celebrities do in recent days, was invented by our ancient Indian surgeon, Shushrata, the father of surgery, father of Indian medicine. He considered surgery as the first and foremost branch of medicine. Who is an ideal surgeon according to Shushrata? A person who possesses courage and presence of mind, who has tremorless grip of sharp and good instruments, who carries his operations to the success and advantage of his patients, the patient who has entrusted his life to the surgeon. Shushrata lived in the ancient city of Kashi, now known as Varnasi. Even few researchers show that Shushruta was present even before or during Mahabharata times, that is, during 6 millennium BC. He got inspired from soldiers who got hurt during war. He cured them using his surgical methods. Many ancient manuscripts still serves as a proof of this. One of the oldest palm leaf manuscripts of Shushruta Samhita, his influential work has been discovered in Nepal. It is preserved at the Kaiser Library in Nepal as a manuscript. The partially damaged manuscript is written in traditional Gupta script. Shushruta Samhita is the main source of knowledge about surgery, which explains the step-by-step -step procedure of surgery with accuracy, classifying pediatric surgery, ear surgery, urinary stones, anatomy of urinary bladder, intestinal obstruction and so on. References of brain surgery, abdominal surgery, cesarean, dental surgery, cataract and more than 300 plus kinds of surgeries. He has also described various reconstructive procedures for different types of defects. The book is translated into many languages as well. He had invented around 120 plus surgical instruments, the famous rhinoplasty, nose remaking surgery which is famous in the recent days was a phenomenal invention. Maharishi Shushruta was a pioneer of Anastasia too by using intoxicants such as wine. He used the technique skin grafting which is even today the basics of plastic surgery. He was one of the first in human history to suggest that a student of surgery should learn about human body and its organs by dissecting a dead body. His greatest historically important work Shushruta Samhita kindled the interest among everyone to know more about Indian medicinal sciences. Even today, it is a key reference for all surgeons and still followed by modern science of surgery. Let's not forget from where it all started. It is important for all of us to appreciate where we come from and how that history has shaped us. Mm -hmm.